Greetings, boys and girls. My name is Aridan Kane. Today, we're hunting Snallygasters. Snallygasters are grotesque cryptids known for the acid and the asbestos as they drop. Today, I'll show you four guaranteed locations where you can find Snallygasters, followed up by three locations that they randomly spawn. Now that you know what we're doing, let's get started. We'll start with the four locations that are guaranteed to have Snallygasters, unless somebody has already taken them out, of course. The first spot is the flooded train yard in the Cranberry Bog. It's in the southeast corner and it's just east of Watoga. The flooded train yard will have seven Snallygasters. And all we're gonna do is head straight forward from the spawn point and we should start to see them popping up here anytime. There's two right there. Let's go ahead and grab those. As you can see, they drop Snallygaster hide, which is good for leather, uh, asbestos, and then also waste acid. All very important resources by themselves, but together in one monster, kind of nice. So that's the first two in this location. Um, usually back in this building, there is, there'll be one Snallygaster that's like trapped. And watch out for these traps right here as well. There he is. Grab him real quick. The glowing ones can also have nuclear waste, which is kind of nice as well. Snallygasters are the gift that keeps on giving. Um, so that is three. And here's four. Oh, we shot him all the way across the yard. And then if we go down this way, there's five. Down here will usually be six and seven. And there they are. And that will do it for the flooded train yard. For our next location, we're gonna head north up here to Toxic Larry's Meet and Go. So Toxic Larry's Meet and Go will have a total of three Sally Gassers. You can see them right there on the other side of our tree. Uh, so this one's super quick. We're just gonna run up there and take them out. And again, these were all glowing, so they have a chance to drop nuclear waste, but they didn't. Oh, they did. We got one of them at least. So we'll go ahead and take all of that. And note that there's also a lot of other junk up in the shack that's uh, pretty nice. For our next guaranteed location, we're gonna head up here to Hemlock Holes. So from the spawn point here at Hemlock Holes, we're just gonna head south to the backside of the uh, building. And then what we're looking for is that crashed vertebrate. And you can probably already see that there are two Snallygasters there. Let's go ahead and get our chainsaw out. And we will take these two guys out. Now again, waste acid, asbestos, and Snallygaster hide all good things. If you're here hunting for acid, then it's also worth noting that there is a Grafton monster just over here to the uh, to the east there. Run over and take him out real quick. So waste acid and oil from the uh, Grafton monster. And if you're interested in hunting Grafton monsters, I've also got a video that I'll link up in the corner uh, to do just that. So now moving on, we'll hit our final guaranteed location. It's down here in Charleston, in the southern part of the forest, right before you get to the ash heap. And for this one, we want to hit Charleston exactly, not the Herald or any, not the Capitol building, but Charleston proper. So from the Charleston waypoint, what you want to do is find that bridge, keep it on your right, and then we're going to head right down here. 
and then kind of follow this path, and that should be our first Snallygaster right ahead of us. And then what we're going to do is basically head to the southeast. And we're going to pass this blue building. And you're going to run into some other things. Scorched are pretty common. There could be some uh, super mutants as well. But once we get past the blue building right there, we should find our Snally Gaster right there. Right in front of us. Go ahead and take him out. Again, we got some asbestos and waste acid and Snallygaster hide. Now, if you're also hunting for acid, then we're gonna keep running this way. And pass up all this stuff. And then you'll see that kind of clip side right there. We run right there. We will find, emerging from the water, another Grafton monster. So we'll take him out real quick too. And this is specifically if you're hunting acid as well. So that's going to do it for our four guaranteed locations. We've also got several locations that are common for them to spawn, uh, but won't be guaranteed. The first of those locations is going to be the Kitty Corner Cabins. It's located here in the northern part of the uh, Toxic Valley. So the Kitty Corner Cabin Cabins have a uh, big, you've got a 50-50 shot. You'll either get uh, rat scorpions or you'll get snallygasters like we got this time. If you get snallygasters, there will usually be three scattered around here. You may have to go looking for them a little bit. There's another one. I bet his buddy's on the other side of the cabin there. Oh, there he is. Yeah, there's always three of them, but like I said, you may have to go looking for them a little bit. Our next common location for Snallygasters is going to be the treetops. It's located right here in the uh, mire before you get to Cranberry Bog. So we'll go ahead and fast travel there. So here we are at the treetops, and there's one of three things that'll spawn here. We'll either get honey beasts, mega sloths, or Snallygasters. Let's see what we got. Sounds like we got Snallygasters. There we go. So there's one. And there should be a total of three. There we go. There's two and then three. And a Scorch Beast. Because of course we got a Scorch Beast. And we are going to head on to our next location. And this will be our final non-guaranteed spawn location. And it's right here at Pylon V13. So for Pylon V13, I think you have about a 50-50 shot. It'll either be Fog Crawlers or Snallygasters. And in this case, we got Snallygasters. So there should be a total of three, I think. So at least two. I'm pretty sure there is another one here somewhere. Okay, only two Snallygasters. If you're looking for more creatures that drop acid as Snallygasters do, click the top video beside me where I'll show you how to hunt the Grafton monster. Or click the bottom video for my acid farming guide. Have a wonderful day and thanks for watching.